Each pad in MPC machine has its own dedicated page, allowing you to sculpt the samples on the pad. For instance, you can alter the volume, change the pitch, pan to create space, or even apply multi-effects, such as reverb and delay. It's quick and easy to make changes to a drum pad sound. First, select the pad with the sound you want to edit. It will show that it's selected as it will be highlighted with a yellow border. There are two ways to navigate the different pad pages. The first way is to press the one button and then use the cursor left or right keys to flip pages until you get to the page you want. Alternatively, the second way is more efficient depending on your workflow. Simply keep your finger pressed down on the shop icon button. After a brief second the pads will change, each pad showing a different page that you can go to. Simply press the pad with the name of the page you wish to go to, and you will be taken to that page immediately. In this example, we will press the page shortcut which will take us to change the sample's pitch. For the pages with two or more dots underneath, simply tap the same pad again to go to the other pages. For this example we will go to the send effect to add a touch of delay to this pad. Repeat the process again to quickly go to the other pages if need be. Thank you for watching this tip. I hope you found it useful.